All right, we're going to resume the recording. And we are going to make this GPS rocket. The tier two. So we need a rocket engine, two compasses, and three super alloys. Three super alloys. A rocket engine requires one super alloy, two uranium, and iridium rod. Two uranium. And an iridium rod, which I don't have. Now we're to find iridium, though. Iridium stock is already complete again. right here not with what I have on me but what if what with I have on me and what I have at the base so I will make a rocket and I will make another ore excavator because I didn't realize I just extract other things other than iridium I thought it was a straight shot for iridium so why not I'll take it all back with me so I need two iridium rods. There's the rocket engine. Now what do we need for these guys? Four aluminum, two magnesium, two silicon. We're running out. That should be everything for the rocket. One more super alloy. Oh, I didn't grab one for the rocket engine. What happened? Bam. Should have mapping, right? Yes, sir. This map sucks. This map truly sucks. What do I need for this guy? Osmium. Super alloy. Aluminum. Titanium. Iridium. Damn. Hydration low. Got my flower spreader. my cobalt that's cool uh water yeah. 
Alright, what to do, what to do. These guys are all done. How much? Only 35? Alright, beans are worth more. bean in and two mushrooms as biolab only gives me explosive powder at the moment and I guess fertilizer but fertilizer isn't my biggest concern explosive powder gives me the better agility boots but I don't really need it Don't even a tier 4 tank. Ah, fuck it, I'll do it. Two. Two sulfur, one iridium. Pretty fast, I will say. Jetpack is still faster, but I think it increases my jetpack speed also. Alright, we're about to be a man on a mission. I had explosive powder in here, I don't even need to craft it. Three oxygen capsules. We're gonna go all the way over here and we're gonna go find something. Grab whatever uranium I can find. Because I haven't really explored this way too much. I've explored over there, not over there. There also looks like something, something up there. I've been wrong about that before. This is just a wreckage site, I'm pretty sure. Nothing of importance. Nothing. Nada. Yeah, I'm scared to traverse anywhere, because I can make it out of bounds real easily. And at what point do I make it out of bounds and I can't return? Also looking like there's not a whole bunch over here.
bleeding. Give me a sec. Take too long. Uh, but we found something. We actually found something. Oh, is this the uranium cave? Cool. Badly we needed it. Iridium rods are cool. I mean, also, I thought the world was over. I thought we reached the limit of everything to see, and then I found that little secret tunnel, and I was like, "Damn, this gotta be a bug or something." There's no way this is intentional because it looked—it looked fucking like they left a giant hole in the map. In my opinion, but uh, no, it's uh, well now I now I think this is nothing. That is most definitely nothing out there. I wonder if I can get Osmium Meteors to crash at some point. Not seeing a whole lot. Also running out of inventory space. I don't know where I am or an easy way to get out of where I am. Well, I found an easy way to get out of where I am is the fact of, uh, not open. Pull up an Osmium, then we'll head out. Try and find the best way we can back. the best way back home. Do I know what that way is? Not really. But I have two oxygen tanks. What is this? Even more resources that I don't have a use for? Pulsar quartz? The pink rare one. What the fuck is this place? More osmium is out in the open now. And a microchip. I'm gonna get rid of that. Drink that, because I'm gonna need it. Yeah, I need to find a way back home. I have so much shit on me. I have 
one capsule left. There's gotta be an easy way back home that's not going, that's not backtracking. If it's not an easy way, there's gotta be a way to exploit the map. Yeah, so now I have two resources I have found that I don't have a... I don't have a use for. Please tell me back this way. Not looking like it. Which is currently shitty for me. But I... I think I can exploit the map, mapping and terrain. Yes, I can. Alright. So, we know where everything is to go exploring now. Also, this lake has filled up quickly. I don't think I've had this much fun with an open world survival craft in a long while. Some uranium rods. I don't need them. Put that there. We have our osmium. Uranium. Aluminum. Super alloy. And the microchip. Something good? Dead factory. Oh, this is a big day. Oh, it does the wrong thing. Two explosive powder, a super alloy, and two osmium. Honestly, not the most difficult thing to craft. Alright, let's see this. with the drills is that now I don't need to worry about all these minor resources too because now I have a supply of silicon, titanium, iron, magnesium, iridium, and cobalt. A whole bunch of basic resources. I don't need to go out looking for them. They just come to me. And I do want to do some renovations to the base so... I want to see what this living, the big one is. I'm pretty sure it's just a 4x4, four four, but what does it look like on the inside? Oh, that can be interesting. some renovations. Let's see, how are we gonna do this? I wanna build it into the side of the mountain. The best I can, at least. Make it look natural and stuff.
Damn, just like that. I don't have an idea of what I want to do either. I don't just I want to do something, I just don't know what of. That's funny. Fighters, and then one more. Where did that go? I think that's how I'm gonna do it. Just have little dividers in between each one. Silicon. There's gonna be one just lying around, right? this is the openness and roominess of it I think it's what we're gonna do Put the bio lab on this side This will be a little project I do while offline. But for now, it's snazzy looking. Uh, what's the plan? What's the plan? What's the plan? More ore extractors, I guess. Pressing the wrong button to get out of screens and then two titanium. Not the biggest, not the worst decision in the world. 
plenty of room too. No reason not to place them next to each other. But it's like, oh, they're just all gonna collect iridium, and it's like, yeah, it doesn't really fucking matter if they all collect iridium. Iridium's an important resource in getting these guys operating. Actually, I will place just one out here in the open. Gathering straight iron. Sulfur. Go grab some of that. Grab one more uh, oxygen capsule too, because I want to explore that. I want to explore the area with all the dust and whatnot. The the dust waterfall. We've made a lot of progress today. I'm proud. I also definitely think this is a good place to mine for sulfur. I guess if uh, whatever aluminum I see I can grab, since that is now one of the resources we're running out of. Aluminum and sulfur. Already been in here. I think I have. Like the sulfur that's in here, though. Easier to spot than the ones out there. Probably grab maybe ten. Enough for five explosive bags. Don't see the need to craft that much right now. All right, two more sulfur. The rest aluminum. Sulfur, that, that. How did I miss this? Some good stuff in there. I think, yeah, we just need one more sulfur. Then we're at the limit I set for myself. That means nothing, because I could easily go over it. Ballistic nuggets are for yet. I also think this is a landing site. The sandy waterfalls or whatever they're called. I also did not expect to be able to fly up them and get sent to a new land. That was not on my list of expectations. That's what I've been like. I, I, like, not that's what I've been liking, but that's what I just liked about this game, like, just recently. Is that you, at some point, you think you reach the end of everything, and you're like, alright, cool, now it's just upgrading to beat the game. And then you find this little thing that you're like, maybe I'm not supposed to do this. And then you're like, what the? Where am I? And I feel like that's kind of like real life planet exploration. You find this, like, little cave you don't think you're supposed to go down. And then you start, like, alright, maybe there's something cool down here or whatnot. You go down and it's like, what? There's, like, a whole different... There's, like, a whole bunch of different shit over here. There's so much more things and, like, things to explore and learn about. I feel like that's what it is here. You find something and it's like, I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing this, but whatever, we're gonna break the game. 
then you get to that point and it's like, okay, this was intentional. Peter 3, I see it somewhere. I don't have room for all these heaters. I would love to, but I just don't. Gotta be something worthwhile back here. Give another gold seed. I will say there's a lot of aluminum I can deconstruct from these guys. A lot of resources I'm gonna get when I come back here. Another rocket engine is awesome. Don't need that iron. Take it for uranium instead. Alright, well, now we know there's a cool ship back here with a whole bunch of stuff to dismantle. And I mean a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, microchip. What do I drop? We consume this, grab the microchip, now we leave. We also did that, because that's worth nine uh, uranium compared to the one uranium that I've created with it. Uh, nothing else of big importance. Definitely have to make some trips back here. And I mean some because there's a lot of stuff back there. At least two more trips. But no, it, it definitely makes sense to me. And I hope it makes sense to the whole... It feels like you're breaking the game going out of bounds and you just find something awesome and cool. I definitely broke the game getting the fucking the rare white ore. Whatever it's called, the Zellite, the Zelolite. For that, I definitely wasn't supposed to get access to just yet. Because there was plants growing up there and I don't have access to uh, plant growth that immense just yet. So it's supposed to be like, you're supposed to get to that spot way after you get plants. So it's like, oh, plants are growing on the planet and whatnot. So they're just set in stone to be there. I think it's kind of funny. We're gonna craft another reactor. Just because I can and want to. A lot of aluminum. Construction menu filter? What? Magnesium silicon super. What does that mean? Equipped. Oh, hides lower tier of objects from the construction menu. Okay, so it declutters the construction menu. That's cool. That's kind of like, why do I need lower tier objects? And if I do need it, I can just get rid of the thing. Hundred sixty one oxygen per second. What's my other oxygen per second thing? So nine point two plants per second isn't bad. I think it's the biodome. It's one hundred thirty five. Oxygen should not be my worry right now. I have so much oxygen growing, but that the biomass is what I need. And we'll do three. Or not three, two. So, six water bottles. 
two super alloys. One, two fertilizer, but I only have one at the moment. And two magnesium. We get another fertilizer. I will need no clue because I moved my fucking bio lab. Get another fertilizer. I will need algae, which I don't have access to. I mean, I have access to, I just don't have it currently. So we are not going to do that at this current moment in time. Wasting everyone's time, and I'm sorry. But we can do this guy. Two sulfur, iridium, three water bottles. It will jump us up from 125. Two, maybe like four hundred. Yeah, four fifty six. Why don't I have access to my? That's why I don't have access to my tier twos. Because it's all submerged underwater. We're gonna go grab our old base. The rest of it. Yeah, I was like, don't I have a whole bunch of tier 2s over here? I did have a whole bunch of tier 2s over there. I think these just take so much fucking space. There we go, that's that. Grab these guys. Good for our base adventures for now. I will say this thing filled up pretty fucking quickly. I need to go look at the blueprints and see what I should be crafting right now. Can't do anything about that. Deposit all my iron, magnesium, silicon, cobalt, save that. low. No, it's not. Don't ever lie to me again. Biodome 2 generates tree bark. Gas extractor is not happening for a while. So biomass is both plants and insects. This is looking like. Alright, we're gonna go for heat right now. Uh, we 
we can craft two, so we need two silicon, two titanium, which I don't have, and two aluminum. There we go. Plenty of resources now. Let's see what to do, what to do. How do we get super alloys? That is my question right now. Super alloy requires a lot. Yeah, there's a lot I can do, but look at that, Pulsar Quartz. I already found Pulsar Quartz, and it's like endgame material. Teleporter would be nice, but that's way out of my league. Uh, let's start working on Algae. An algae thing requires eggplant. I have two of. We will get rid of some green beans. We'll get more eggplants. All right. I can craft one. I realize this now, that I probably should have just crafted one. So it's what, three water bottles, fertilizer, super, magnesium. This requires two supers, two water bottles, two magnesiums, two neuro or bioplastic energies. So we'll put one flower spreader, I don't know, right here. North of our algae collector is right over here. Right on the edge of the water. terraforming this planet. I know what we can do. We can go back to the thing and grab a whole bunch of tier 3 heaters and bring them back over here. That's what we can do right now.
How much is a tier 3 heater? Four? We should be able to grab them all then. But I think there's only like, what, five or six? There's 20, which is way... We have so much inventory space right now. I just want to say, I think it's cool as shit. I can run almost this fast in my jetpack. There also has to be some secret in this Dust Falls. I guarantee you, there's like some hidden cave in here. Also, please tell me this is more land I can explore. Oh, it so is, because there's a satellite right there. We have found so many things that we can explore. We just don't have the backpack space to do it. We get caught up in one thing and then we leave it behind. Have we seen this guy over here? If he has water, I'll take it because currently dying. More eggplants would be nice. Grab the aluminum and everything else. Can't deconstruct anything up here. Grab that. I said definitely multiple trips. I still stand by that pack. We're having a meteor shower right now. No. No, definitely not. I actually don't know what made me believe that. There's definitely not a meteor shower going on right now. Not at all. Like, why would I even think that? Like, there's no such thing as a meteor shower all the way out here, too? Absolutely ridiculous. One more. Yeah, I don't want to drop anything. I have some really good stuff on me. Let's see, is it an iridium or is it a, a normal meteor shower? Yeah, normal meteor showers aren't fun. I was kind of hoping that meteor showers from now on would either be iridium or uranium. I don't think so. I think I have to send a rocket up for all that. So we can craft three heaters. Which should push us towards the next upgrade. I forgot what it was already. I need to start. I'll, I just need to do a whole bunch. There is so much stuff I need to do. I think I'm gonna start playing this in my off time. I haven't before because like, there's so much to. Ex I needed to explore to get stuff. Now it's kind of like, I need to just do stuff to get stuff. So I think now is a good time to start playing in off time, collecting resources, whatnot.
as close to the wall as possible. So I can fit one more in there. Super. Balloon. Cobalt. Uranium. It's gonna suck when I move all this stuff. Again. I don't think it'll actually be that difficult, because I have it in place of order of in the resource importance. Iron, titanium, silicon, magnesium, cobalt. And then in order I found it, uranium, aluminum, random miscellaneous, super. Yeah, so on, so on. It makes sense to me, alright? I don't really need a compass, I will say that. So what am I trying to get right now? Biodome 2? Send another heat rocket into space, I guess. Yeah, let's do that, and it'll also summon uranium. Two super, three cobalt, rocket. Rocket. Two super, three cobalt. Build this fucker. Like a whole bunch of uranium. Alright, so we were at like 3,000%. Or we were at like 3,000 heat. Now we're at 7,000 heat. And now we should get a whole bunch of uranium asteroids. thing to go away so I can actually see everything. Dude, this game's just so fucking cool. Like, look at that. Look at these asteroids crash. I don't know, man. This game is so fucking cool. I also think it would be cool for your oxygen to bleed it twice as fast while you're underwater. That's because you don't have oxygen outside and then you're also underwater. Don't you need oxygen to make water? How is there still no oxygen in the atmosphere? We have literal clouds, rain, and lakes. This game's mind blowing with its realism. We've already explored this guy, we've explored this guy. There's a base over here too that you can't see because the quality sucks the more you go out. This guy was the first thing we explored. Three algae, a whole bunch of eggplants. even ready to grow. Is that a miscellaneous? I'm gonna clear out my extractors right now. I hope the tier 2 also increases the size of these things. the size of the storage crates.
It sorts it by alphabetical order. Doesn't I realize this? Miscellaneous locker. Of craft two. I was wondering how it sorted things, but it just sorts alphabetically. One rock is going to prohibit me from doing this drill. Biodome, too. I'm also getting another meteor shower, it looks like. It's only got 10. Consider 12 of each. And how much power do we have left? 274 still, because we literally can't run out of power. We have 11,000 power, 1100 power production, and we're only spending 900 of it. Burning these towers. I really don't like them. You don't need cobalt for super. I guess. Oh, because it takes two cobalt for them. Yeah, if I had more titanium, I would just make a whole bunch of super alloys. But literally, I have no titanium. I could grab a whole bunch on the ground, but... What's the point of drills if I'm just gonna get the resources myself? Am I right, or am I right?
Biodome Q. Bacteria sample and fertilizer. So I need what? 12 algae? Yeah, I have three on me right now. I have four on me now. I wonder if I rock off a rock, it'll just drop instantly. It did. It it did. You saw that, right? Yeah, it still drops you off almost instantly if you're walking underwater. Eh, maybe not. I don't know, I think I'm just tripping. Literally no clue what's going on anymore. Got three more algae. Alright, bathroom time. I'll leave this running. Never need to pause it.
I die? Oh, I guess I did. Uh, right now, I want to build more veggie tubes. Water, silicon, magnesium. I wonder where I can get more fucking water. Yeah, I want more veggie tubes. Awesome. Literally just fucking restocked on it not too long ago. Why not? To, oh, we'll fucking grab all the seeds we can. Every high class seed. have legs finished. Biomass is at a good rate. More eggplants. Good, good. Is it for fertilizer again? Two eggplants. Oh, it's a tier two algae generator, that's why. Let's go see what algae we have over there now. I was like, I don't remember algae regenerators requiring algae to craft. back and my eggplants back we yeah, I deconstruct them and craft two uh tier twos requires super alloys magnesium two water bottles four nuggets Fertilizer. Fertilizer just requires these and eggplants, I'm pretty sure. And sulfur. Quicker. 
uranium. Yeah, I forgot to grab all this from the meteor shower that happened a while ago. It looks so cool underwater. The uranium, not the actual, like, visual effects. back to this ship because I was looking at things while I went to the bathroom and I pretty sure there's something over here yes this right here and we deconstruct it for aluminum and super alloy Golden crates are a thing in the game. And they just have some really good resources inside them. A decoration display pieces, gold seeds. I don't think that crate I found on the other ship was a gold crate. I don't remember it being. In fact, we can go look at it now. Green vibes. I got the achievement. It wasn't... Was it this guy? It was. Yep, I don't have it yet. That's not it either. the gold seed yet. Head back to it, don't I? Have I never gone back to that ship? no way I never went back to that ship. Is this where I got the thing for the gold seed? Nope. There's no way. I got a gold seed. This is where I got the achievement. Just walking right up to it. And it's like, hey, discover your first gold seed. And I'm like, what are you talking about? Lying on the ground, wasn't it? If I need eggplant seeds, I will say I go back. Tuska, Estera, Nolna. 
Oh, I do have it. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it. When did I get it? And is that chest golden? And did I ever dismantle the golden chest? Nope, I already have it. Right there, it was just sitting on the ground. Alright, cool, so there was no golden chest. I'm not crazy. I promise, I'm not crazy. This tier 2 biodome, biodome would be awesome. That's the bacteria sample, which is created from 6 algae. So I need 12 algae to create this biodome. We will hit the ending of lakes by the end of this stream. Been up for maybe a quarter of the time and have doubled what our tier ones did. Grab all this water. The eight. So we need a lot more. Twelve. Grab our eggplants. I can only craft one fertilizer because I don't have enough eggplant. And they're not even halfway done. I could get rid of uh, one of my things, but I don't want to. Sulfur, super alloy. Put all that there. I only need three of these at the current moment of time. Ah. 
I say once we hit the next stage, it'll be good to end it off. It's been about four hours. Oh, it will be four hours by the time this finishes. And I'm happy with the progress we've made. Extremely happy with the progress we have made. In the meantime, throw all that there. Start working on this base a little bit. Bring some cobalt, so hopefully some of this has it. Yeah, we have plenty. what I want. We actually can't do right now. Here we go. What I want is this. I hate how it's not connecting to what I what I wanted to connect to. Why is it connecting to the weirdest fucking spots right now? Right, let's do this. Do that. We're gonna connect it to this guy. There we go. Some ladders. Easy climbing. And that's why I needed the cobalt. I like how I'm actually using this to not grab iridium. I really don't want to start burning through my supply. I'm, I will get this cobalt, it's the last thing I fucking do. Alright, that cobalt gets to live. Cobalt I got away. still a lot of ice on the ground where it's not sunny out. Inventory full? Cool. Just need four cobalt and two more iron. One more cobalt. 
There we go. This is what I wanted to do on the other side, or on my other base. work. There we go. A little corner desk now. Marine for a shelf. Cobalt and a super alloy. Cobalt, super alloy. Grab you. some titanium in there. Let's go. Let's go. Magnesium. Blueprints. Energy levels. Blueprints, energy levels, transmissions, and mapping. We need transmissions. We will put our display locker over here. Also, our eggplant should be ready. They are not ready yet. I've been lied to by myself. I can start tossing some of this stuff. Iron 
titanium, a whole bunch more iron. can do. What if I put fabric? I'm liking it up there. I'm looking all nice and cozy. But we have a mission. We have a bio lab to create. Hey, do we we finished flakes? What's next? Moss? That is blanked. Uh we need Fertilizer, correct? Yes. And with that, we can create our biodome too. Literally can't make it because of the giant rock in the way. I can, though, make it connect like that. That is probably what I'm going to do. Oh, I can get auction in doing this. Fucking awesome. is generating tree bark. Alright, y'all. I think I'm gonna end this one here. Uh, I'm sorry it was just one game today. I just got really intrigued into it. We beat, uh, Judah's Blood and Teeth also. So, wanted to do some planet crafting. Uh, I'm gonna fuck around and build up this base in the meantime, in the off time. And yeah. Other than that, I'll see you all in the next one.